How did Nathan enjoy your blue hair? He said I look like ninja. I actually like my blue hair a lot. I might keep it forever now. I'm so sorry. <laughs> I have never gotten, this must be like what pretty women or maybe pretty men feel like. I have never gotten so much attention from women in my entire life. It's actually insane. It is so easy because every girl will like look at my hair and they see it. And like a lot of them will stop and say like, oh my God, like such a nice hair. I've never had like a girl compliment me before randomly in public. Probably never in my entire life. I don't think I've ever in my entire life had a girl stop me like, wow, you're so handsome. Or you're so like, maybe like my mom. But I've had like probably over 15 people in the past like two weeks, women, um, half of them older, like 40s or 50s or whatever, like just being polite. And then like the other half, like probably like, yeah, like late 20s, 30s, they're like, oh, nice hair, whatever. Especially if I'm like an elevator with a woman, it's like an instant conversation starter. Like it's insane. Um, Jesus Christ, yeah. Are they joking? No, I mean, it does look nice. All right, I think, well, it's a little fucked right now because I didn't use my blue conditioner today, but I think the color is pretty nice. It's starting to green a little bit, but it's because I didn't use the blue conditioner today. Um, I'll probably re-dye professionally next time instead of like doing the self-dye. Although the guy did a good job on it, so. But yeah, I don't know. But I think my issue before with like doing hair dye is um, I don't like the way my hair feels, which sucks. Well, it doesn't feel as bad anymore that I've conditioned it a fuck ton. Um, the thing that I always worried about is that I don't like I, when I see dyed hair, I associate it usually with two things. One is with not very vibrant colors. Like this blue is like, especially on the top cell, is like a really cool color blue. So I like that. And then two, a lot of product. I don't like product, um, but that just might be because I'm a fucking loser or conservative upbringing or whatever. I don't like a lot of product in hair, like the spiky shit. Um, if, if I feel like if I touch your hair, if it's gonna feel crusty, it is one of the biggest turnoffs. I think it's like one of the big things that keeps you from being like really bisexual is like fucking men's hair. Because like traditionally nice looking guys always have product in their hair. And I don't know, when it comes to like women, like one of the funnest things is like, I wanna like touch your hair and like run my fingers through like your scalp. Like that's like a fun, intimate thing to do. And I would never touch a guy's hair ever. It's like the most disgusting fucking thing in the world. We had to touch a guy's hair and feel like the fucking polyurethane force field of nasty fucking gel and what I could never do it. It's fucking gross. It it's like one of the most disgusting, it's like shit. It's actually shit. Like if I went to like finger a girl and she turned around and there was shit smeared on her asshole and I could smell it wafting up, like she fucking smeared. That's what that's what product in men's hair is for me. That's how fucking gross it is. So yeah, I don't know. But anyway, that's the reason why I traditionally didn't like uh, dyed hair is because I've always seen, seen it that way. Uh, Raptor Balls, thanks for the 49.99 again, my friend. Me. All right, bye. Remember to hit that like and subscribe and don't forget the notification bell so that my videos show up right in your feed. Ah. <sighs>